Thank you very much, Alra. I appreciate it, the introduction, and thanks to Channel Sale for making this happen today. Um, my name is James Ferrier, uh, Director of Marketplace Sales for Shop.com. Um, we thank everybody for listening in to this webinar uh, regarding the marketplace seller opportunities and um, basing, basically, if you're not aware, giving you a, a background about who we are, um, what we do, and um, what makes us a little different than maybe some of the other marketplaces out there. So we look forward to uh, hopefully sharing some information with you, and we're happy to answer any questions once the webinar and the slides are complete. Um, I'll allow Eddie to introduce himself now. Nice to meet everyone, and thank you again for the opportunity. Uh, we embrace these types of opportunities because we pride ourselves on working very closely with sellers um, and providing that unique difference. So we always want to have that relationship in place. So again, thank you for the opportunity. So again, um, the shop.com marketplace and, you know, a little bit about what we're going to talk about today. So we'll, we'll give you a little bit of background um, on the shop.com marketplace powered by Market America, who we are, um, what our standing is, and um, also a little bit about the shop.com marketplace difference. We all know there's a lot of marketplaces out there. Um, some of them vary from size to um, to scale, and some of them vary from customer um, to, to model. So we're going to give you a little bit of the reasons why shop.com is a little different than some of the others out there. We're also going to talk to you a little bit about some of the marketing support and the opportunities that you'll be afforded um, if you decide to partner with shop.com. Um, I think one of the things that we we like to Think that makes us a little different is that, as Eddie mentioned, we like to foster that relationship with the partner, build that relationship, and work hand in hand on doing the best we can to drive as much business as possible for you. Lastly, we're going to talk a little bit about how it all works and how we're going to get started, and then we'll discuss a little bit about our rate card and our fees. So, a little bit about shop.com marketplace um, to start shop.com has been around uh, quite some time uh, at, really born in the late 90s um, has been a e-commerce player for for a couple of decades now um, five or six years back we were purchased by a company called market America and currently uh, in 2016 we we're number 66 on Internet Retailers 2016 Top 500 Guide. We're still waiting for the 2017 numbers um, that are coming out in the spring. Currently have over 3, 3 million active customers that we're constantly communicating with um, via email. We're currently approaching 750 million in annualized retail sales, and this is a figure that represents Market America Worldwide and Shop.com. We currently have millions of monthly unique visitors, and that number typically, as you would imagine, varies on the season, um, can be anywhere from three to nine million unique visitors every month um, based on the time of year. And we pride ourselves on always coming out with new features on the site and new ways to, to work with our partners, um, like our, our, our very strong shop.com mobile app, the home shopping list, our auto ship program, and always more to come. Eddie, would you like to talk about the shop.com marketplace difference a little bit? Sure, happy to do so. <clears throat> so one of the things that James mentioned is there's a lot of marketplaces out there that you, as sellers, probably choose from. Some may want to be on all marketplaces. Some may look for uh, those that fit 
you know, their needs best. And some of the things that I think that are differentiators between us and other marketplaces are simply that, you know, you have the opportunity to gain access to a new market of very loyal customers. Um, people powered distribution network. So, so what does that mean? You know, and simply put, Market America, as James mentioned, acquired shop at the end of 2010. Market America has been, uh, was started in 1992, um, primarily started as a direct sales company. Um, so if you're familiar with that type of business model, you're aware that, you know, we have a number of very, very loyal customers that also act as if they're a brand ambassador in many cases. And it simply works like this. Market America has our own products, primarily in health and nutrition, cosmetics, skin care, consumable-like products that we uh, have manufactured for us um, and that we sell on shop.com, as well as our uh, brand ambassadors can sell those products sometimes offline in a you know, one-to-one -one type of relationship or marketing relationship. Well, those same brand ambassadors purchase what we call one cart products, which James will talk to you, but we have a patent on it. It's simply our universal shopping cart, and they're there buying vitamins. So they can also buy another product from your assortment or your catalog and check out using one payment method. Um, what, you know, and that really helps conversions go way up. And so these brand ambassadors, once they have a good experience with products, they do like most of us do, whether it be on social media or they tell someone, they influence family members, friends, next door neighbors, somebody they're at the gym with, et cetera, about products and in some cases services on shop.com. So it's, I think that's a real key differentiator for us and, and feel free to ask any questions at the end, but that brand ambassador, that customer that has a little bit more incentive because we are a loyalty model and they're incentivized by cash back and by points to purchase more. And they'll spread the word and socialize that with other potential customers as well. Uh, as James mentioned, you know, obviously we're, we're strong with desktop and have a great website, but we also have a strong mobile app and social media, as I mentioned. The other key differentiator, I would say, and I'm sure that you probably hear this with most marketplaces, is that you'll have a dedicated account manager. And sometimes that may not necessarily be the case. James and I, as well as our team, from an operations standpoint, is always available via email, via call. Sometimes, you know, picking up the phone may be the easiest, uh, but we want to be there to help nurture that relationship, both with implementation as well as marketing, you know, as well as getting involved in some of our emails and other opportunities that we'll talk about here in a minute. Um, you can manage your storefront with our Marketplace Business Center tools, oftentimes referred to as the MBC. Simply put, that's the back office that you'll manage your account in. Um, we have, as James mentioned, a very experienced Marketplace and e-commerce team that's been around for, you know, 20 plus years, um, brand exposure on your storefront and throughout the purchasing process. So we also leverage, um, you know, similar or like product purchases, recommendations, et cetera, on the site. We actually use Adobe Test and Target for that. So there's a number of ways that we'll get your products in front of customers. And then as we briefly touched on, you'll have access to merchandising opportunities including display advertising or banner ads on the shop.com site, most oftentimes within the category of your uh, primary focus, email marketing, social media. We also have some differentiators. We have two live events each year with 20,000 plus people. Uh, they're customers, first and foremost, and it's a good opportunity. They're in a buying mindset. So sometimes we do giveaways, we launch new uh, site enhancements, product announcements, um, partnerships. So this was something that uh, we also mentioned at our last event in Miami World Conference and about the relationship with Channel Sale. And, you know, from a customer standpoint, that just means that there's going to be more sellers, more product assortment 
coming on board very soon. And so they're super excited about that. So the shop.com customer, um, you know, the consumer profile of the CFO, whoever makes those business decisions of the household, typically is 70% female, 30% male, approximate age 30 to 55. I'll say, I said approximate because I've noticed uh, we've started to get a little bit of a Gen Y or younger crowd. We've added PayPal credit and some other you know, what I believe to be uh, Gen Y kind of friendly uh, tools or e-commerce, as well as our um, Asian demographic has done a good job of recruiting that Gen Y or younger crowd. 65% um, are married, 77% own a home, 30% have children under 18, uh, somewhat affluent, if you will, 78,000 average income, and seven out of 10 are pet owners. The biggest thing I think to note here that I just touched on is that we do have a, a fairly considerable size or Asian demographic, um, both here in the U.S. and our second biggest market, Taiwan, which isn't necessarily relative to this discussion, but um, because of the uh, Asian demographic that we have in California and Flushing, New York, et cetera, they have done a really good job of acquiring and, and bringing on customers that are of a little bit younger generation or Gen Y. So, James, I'll let you take it from there. Sure, Eddie, thanks. So, talking about our, our sort of key categories, um, like Eddie just touched on, sort of that female customer, that CFO of the household or the head of household purchasing decisions for the kids, the husband, um, the pets, the babies, the home itself. So we do well with fashion, um, clothing, shoes, and accessories, um, home and housewares, which can be a, a wide-ranging category, as we know, that's a top-level category, but we do very well with home, anywhere from kitchen supplies to furniture to patio furniture. Um, electronics has always been a, a strong category for us. Travel, office, a lot of small business owners, shoponshop.com, the um, brand ambassadors that Eddie referred to, um, have to run their businesses. So we do well with office supplies and ink toners and printing and paper and, and things of that nature. Um, and lastly, um, the, the fastest growing category, I'd say, on the site and um, something that we're really excited to continue to grow is the household consumables, um, grocery, drug, uh, consumer packaged goods, etc. So a lot of our customers, you know, they earn rewards and they want to earn rewards on day-to-day -day purchases. So if you are a seller that offers um, something that you could buy at the grocery store or something you could buy at the drug store, um, Eddie, Eddie and I would love to hear from you. Um, we think that's a, a huge opportunity on shop.com at this time. Um, closed category is uh, vitamins and supplements due to the competitive nature um, with our, with our uh, parent company, Market America. I'd also say cosmetics and skin care is another category that we look at very closely um, in terms of adding to the site because we do have competitive issues there as well. So as we spoke about um, shop.com marketplace loyalty program, you know, we pay customers to shop. So customers on shop.com earn cash back on basically every purchase um, that they make. And shop.com will fund that cash back um, out of our cut of the commission that we're charging you. So this isn't a, any additional cost to you. This is something that we fund, and this is something that we found is an extremely powerful tool for loyalty, repeat buying, um, and all that great stuff. And, and customers accrue that cash back in their account and can either receive a check in the mail once they re reach a certain threshold, which I believe is $25, or they can just use that for future it's, And it's actually $10. They can uh, request a check. 
uh, what we find that a large percentage of our customers tend to accrue that cash back up to, you know, it's 40, 50, 60 dollars, some have hundreds, um, but they actually use that as a form of payment when checking out. Another advantage of being in the one card, if you will, um, is that they're able to use that cash back on account for purchases. Thanks for clearing that up, Eddie. Um, and, you know, one of the other differences with shop.com is expanding your global reach. Um, you know, we have sites in the United States, Canada, Taiwan, Hong Kong, the UK, Australia, Mexico, and China coming soon. Um, however, um, right now, marketplace opportunities and selling on our platform is only available in the US, Canada, and the UK. That could change in the future, probably will change, but those are the opportunities today. So like we spoke of, some of the marketing support and opportunities uh, you, through shop.com, you could reach customers through each channel, social, local, mobile, more. Um, so your products will be published on our mobile app. Um, we do run promotions constantly, so we urge you to work with us to help us promote your store, work with us on getting those assets to help get involved in our promotions. We run um, seasonal promotions, contests, games. We run extra cash back promotions. We're working on a triple cash back promotion coming up this spring, which is really exciting. And those are the levers that we can pull to help you lift up your sales volume. So work with us to get involved. We'll offer you these opportunities, and uh, we'd love to hear from you when, when it comes to running these special promotions. Um, we have an e-gift solution, so use our patented solution to create ready to send e-gifts for customers, and they can use those e-gifts to choose you know, any, any merchant on shop.com to shop from. Um, our hot deals page, um, that's just one of our heavily trafficked pages where um, partners can feature their special promotions, deals, and get a lot of extra visibility. And then our social media platforms, we're always announcing new partnerships, um, exciting things going on, any promotions, any hot deals, any hot products that we think you might like. So that's another avenue to get promoted. This is just an, uh, a screenshot, an example of our shop mobile app. Just an opportunity, another avenue for get a little more exposure through the shop.com network. A few screenshots of our e-gifts and our hot deals um, pages where, um, again, we can feature you and get you more exposure. Yeah, and I think you covered e-gifts, James, but that's one that we do see a large uptick around the holiday shopping time as well as any other, you know, gifting time, you know, it could be birthday, it could be Mother's Day, Father's Day, but it's a pretty neat functionality and our customers definitely use it because oftentimes they may not know, you know, the size or the color that the customer wants and they're able to, to do that. And then once the uh, customer that they're sending it to selects the size or the color, uh, we then bill the original, you know, person that set up the e-gift and then send the order to you, the seller, to fulfill it. So how it all works, um, I think a lot of the sellers that are probably going to be listening to this are, are pretty familiar with working with marketplaces. So I don't think shop.com is overly different um, from a standpoint of operations, but shop.com is the merchant of record. Uh, we do handle the fraud protection on the order. Um, we collect and remit taxes. Um, Shop.com does not bear responsibility and commission for returns or out of stock products. We have a net seven payment threshold. So we will pay you every, the first cycle is 14 days upon signing up. And then after that, we'll pay you uh, every seven days less the commission owed to Shop.com. Um, and in our agreement, we ask that the merchant ships within three business days. 
and we typically, with most of our merchants, have a 30-day return policy. So how do you get started? Um, fairly simple. We have an online merchant application where we look and review and make sure that there are no issues that might be conflicting. And then we work with you directly on our marketplace seller agreement and we agree on business terms and conditions. Once we get that fully executed, we complete that product mapping template on channel sale. We push that over and we begin to launch. So who do we really want to partner with? I mean, as we spoke of earlier, um, we're going to try to avoid the vitamins, the supplements, mostly cosmetics and some skin care. Um, but what we want is for you to have a great reputation in e-commerce. Um, we want you to be able to work directly with us, um, fulfill those orders, um, we're provide us with timely order status, you know, all the nuts and bolts of marketplace selling, we want you to be able to do that with us so we can ultimately give the shop.com customer a strong experience. Um, we have a one-year -term, one term contract, but with termination available by either party at any time, so there's no long-term commitment, um, but we want it to work for you. We do require price parity between your merchant's website and the products offered on shop.com, and for the most part, how you're selling on other marketplaces. So we, we find, we know that the, cus the consumer out there is very savvy. Um, if the prices are gonna be higher on shop.com, they might, they're just gonna find it elsewhere. So we want that parity. Um, as I mentioned, the closed category, and you know, just love gaining access to new customers. We wanna drive new business for you because it's a win-win for the seller uh, our, and ourselves. So our rate card and fees, um, we have a monthly fee of $29.95 per month. Where we wanna waive that for the first year for channel sale partners and adopters. Uh, we want it to work for you. We don't want you to really get locked into any fixed costs and while we ramp you up. So we're, we're offering the first year of that monthly fee for free. Um, we have a referral fee of $1 per order a 3% payment processing and fraud protection fee, and then the category-based pricing, the product commission on the next slide. So this is our product commission. Um, as you can see, it varies a little bit by category. Um, you know, again, I think it's fairly standard across the industry, and we're willing to to discuss with you, and we certainly don't want to be the highest priced marketplace, um, but we want to be competitive with what you're paying on other marketplaces. So that that pretty much you know wraps up the the, the majority of the presentation, you know. Again, we went through this in the beginning slide, but shop.com has a great reputation in e-commerce, been around for a couple decades, growing business, part powered by Market America, and would love to work with you and hear from you. Hey, Eddie and James. Thank you so much for the presentation. And um, we do have a couple of questions coming. So we have Sudhir. Uh, Sudhir, I'll just unmute you. Let me see. Hey, Sudhir. Yeah, yeah actually, I went to your uh, website to register, and there was a question that we have any UK bank account. And uh, we don't because we are based in US. Uh, that was one question. And there was another question, do we ship internationally? We do not uh, currently. So there was, I mean, and also I think I applied online perhaps uh, maybe a couple of months back. And at that point of time, it was declined. So I'm not sure, I mean, what is the current situation? 
Well, if, if, if you'd like to apply again um, or send me a, an email directly at, at jamesf at shop.com, we're certainly happy to look at it again. Um, we do look at each individual application in the in the best light to just look for the highest opportunity of success for both parties. But if you'd like to email me again, I'm happy to reconsider it and discuss with you moving forward. Okay, perfect. I will email you directly. Thank you so much. Great. And, and the, the other question about the UK and the shipping internationally, we typically ask that just because we also have a UK and a Canadian marketplace that uh, you know, it's very similar to, to this setup, and uh, we're just trying to understand, you know, what the capabilities are of the seller. But they're not by any means requirements. Okay. Yeah, I mean, other other marketplaces, I mean, what they do is they, for Canada, for other places, they, we ship for them to their warehouse, and from there they ship it to Canada or other places. Got it. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Sudhir. And uh, so we have another question coming. So you did mention something about cosmetics. Like, you know, so the question is, does shop.com allow selling health and beauty products? And if so, then can, can the seller apply again? I think it's really dependent on specifically what the products are um you know if it's health and beauty is a very wide ranging category so if it's going to be like we said vitamins or supplements probably not if it's going to be a, a strict cosmetics seller um probably not but again um health and beauty covers a wide range of categories so we're more than willing to take a look and uh and reconsider any application that m might be unfairly defined. Sure, sure. We'll, we'll be sure to run that by the seller. Um, another question that came in from one of the sellers is, does shop.com uh, do promotions with regards to products? Sponsor products? Um, specific products? Yeah, yes. Um, you know, I think a lot of promotions that we run are typically store wide, um, but we can on our hot deals page and via social media feature specific products that we think um, maybe the merchant is offering an exclusive. Um, hot deal uh, for shop.com or something um, that might not be available elsewhere on the web that we could really push out via email or social media or on our hot deals page. So um, yes, we can feature products um, if we if we find the deal to be um, you know compelling offer for our customers. Sure, thanks. For your answer, and uh, I have Denise who has a question, so let me try to get her on call. Hello, Denise, can you hear me? Yep, I can hear you. Perfect. And I did so actually I... have a question. I just made a comment that I just made a comment that I'm looking forward to working with James. Hey, that's good news. Been... So we have someone. Come on board. That's perfect. Yeah, hi Denise, good to hear from you and we're looking forward to it as well. Okay, so just a couple of more questions, maybe one or two. So um, a question that just came in, does shop.com offer its own warehouse oh, in the near future? So the answer to that is no. Um, I mean, we do have um, a pretty robust um, warehouse, but that's primarily for um, our own branded products. Um, so we're not doing any fulfillment services at this time. That could change in the next year or two based on the specific category of products that we might decide.
to work with in that sort of nature, but right now the answer is no. Okay. So I guess that's it, James and Eddie. Thank you so much for your presentation and to everyone else for attending this webinar. Um, sure, you guys will have a lot of questions. So what you, you can do is send an email to info at channelsale.com and we in turn will try our level best to answer them. If not, we'll forward them to James and Eddie who will be more than glad to reply. And the recorded version of this webinar also would be sent uh, shortly and we'll keep you guys posted. And thank you once again, everyone. You all have a great day. Thank you, Thank you R.I. and the panel sales team. Thank you. Thank you. Take care.